Oftentimes, we seek expert opinions, somebody outside of ourselves to help us achieve our goals. But sometimes it is our own wisdom that ends up leading us in the right direction. Health and wellness reporter Sonia Azad has tonight's WFAA original. It's 4.30 a.m., the time Greta Ross gets her workout going six days a week without fail. She's not a trainer, no certifications or fancy letters behind her name. At age 61, Greta just found her happy place. <laughs> it wasn't always this easy, the discipline to stick to a routine. I used to weigh 237 pounds. I had acid reflux so bad that I couldn't even lay down and sleep. That was six years ago. Doctors told Greta if she didn't make drastic lifestyle changes, she wouldn't be around much longer. They wanted to put her on meds, but she refused. I had bad habits. I wasn't sleeping properly. I wasn't eating properly. So I knew I had to do something. So I started walking. Walking was one of the only things Greta could comfortably do at the time. And it just became a routine. We would get up every morning, we'd just walk and walk and walk. And next thing I know, the weight just started coming off. One foot in front of the other. Within a year, that old fashioned approach would lead Greta to losing 100 pounds. No surgery, no pills, no dieting. And she's kept the weight off for five years. And I didn't stop. I mean, I just kept going and kept going and kept going. And then when I saw the transformation of my body, my confidence level just went through the roof. It was just incredible. Ready, go. Fitness has become a family affair for Greta. First, hooking her daughter. I just want to do it. I just want to be well for my children, for my grandchildren and things like that. Then her teenage grandson. I told him, I said, some grandmothers play bingo, but this grandmother goes to the gym. Oh, I love it. <laughs> now Greta's inspirational posts about nutrition and wellness on Facebook and Instagram are catching the attention of strangers. The next thing I know, I got people in Nevada, you know, reaching out to me and people in South Carolina and North Carolina and California, all over the place. Feel the burn, feel the burn. <laughs> A message of motivation she hopes will one day reach the masses. Woo! I just tell my real story so that way people will know you can do this. You know, it's, it's not like it's impossible. Is it a journey? Yes. Is it, is it a process? Yes. Does it take time? Absolutely. But you have to be willing to say, I am worth that. My family is worth that. This is what builds that muscle. Sonia Azad, Woo! Channel 8 News. <laughs>